do, do you realize that the position that the president has right now demands some sense of decorum? Decorum has been all over. Mm -hmm. And I have already said that. Mm. To say that the decorum we're talking about as the president, as the father of the mm. whole nation, mm. he is expected to lead by example. Probably that's where you're going. Yes. Now, as a, as a human being, he has demonstrated already that he is a father. You, you can look at dairy papers, people inside the president. You look at the columnists of, of Malawi. Almost each, almost three quarters of the columnists, they just castigate the president, inside the president. You look at radio stations, people, phone-ins. You talk about other politicians, go on radio stations, on TV stations, criticizing the president, insulting the president. He's quiet. He doesn't come in the open and say, why do you do this to me? Mm -hmm. That's a gentleman. It's mm -hmm. a sign of being fatherly. What else do we want? He's already a father. That's decorum enough for me. You, you are press secretary probably number three since President Peter Mutarika took the reins of power. No, uh, number two. Number two? Yes. With one acting probably? Yes. Does that worry you? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. You don't get worried that people have come within a specific period of time and they have gone. I, I don't have to worry because uh, I went to State House on my own. I will live on my own. So if somebody is you live on your own, or uh, do you realize that you can be fired? I can be own? fired. Yes. What do you What do you mean when you say you live on your own? It's It's not only being fired. Mm -hmm. I think uh, democratically, as a human being, mm -hmm. th there can be a point that I would not feel the pinch. I would think that. I better quit. Mm -hmm. That's another way of leaving State House. Okay. So I went alone because the time I was appointed, mm -hmm. I also had the mandate that I could say I'm not going. Mm -hmm. But I went on my own. Mm -hmm. If time comes that I'm fired, or I need that I have to relinquish my mm -hmm. position as press secretary, I'll leave State how, House. How, how does that leave the image of the president? Within a specific period of time, short period of time, three people have been in your office already. I think on that is one, he a tolerant president? <laughs> president Mutarika is very tolerant. <clears throat> the, the, the mistake, that is my view now, mm -hmm. that uh, was made in the first place about the appointments in various offices. Mm -hmm. You heard me, I said the appointment of me into information was strategic. But some of the positions that were made earlier were not made by the president. There were other advisors who were very close to the president, could tell the president, such position, give it, for example, to Brian. Such position, let Gerard take. So even with that, I, want to, I want to hear you very well. Yes. When President Peter Mutarika became the president, yes. there were people that were making appointments on his, on his behalf? Because as the president, mm -hmm. he could not know anyone. He cannot. Even now, there are other people working in the government mm -hmm. of which the president doesn't know. That's a point. So is he in charge? He is very much in charge. If people can make appointments on his behalf. And appointments are not made by the president most of the time. Mm -hmm. there, are recommend there are recommendations mm -hmm. that must take place mm -hmm. within the system. Mm -hmm. And these recommendations have to go up to the highest office. Now, if it has been processed until such a time that it's been recommended for this person to take up this position, mm -hmm. the president endorses. Who, who, who made these on that one, I don't no, know. No, no. I, I don't know if someone. You, you have come here on a national television, exactly, and you're giving us these 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 revelations. No, who, who made these appointments on behalf of the president? You look at um, Mr. positions Viola. of. Um, yes. Yeah, we have the chief secretary mm -hmm. in office. Yes. Who is the in charge of the civil service? Mm -hmm. Who is the driver mm -hmm. of the country? So this is, um, chief secretary has got even people that he entrusts whenever it comes to feeling of government positions. Mm -hmm. So that's how it moves. After that is done, the chief secretary will just recommend to the president or through some other means to say such position would be better filled by such kind of a person. That's what I'm trying to say. So it's not sometimes, even so, if you look at the commission, yes. commissioners mm -hmm. that are put in various boards. Mm. It's not President Mutarika hiring and them. And those after they have gone the real process that uh, ha has taken uh, maybe people that are technocrats that mm -hmm. have vetted their CVs and all that, mm -hmm. and these people they recommend to the president. I, I want to hear you very right. Yes. President Mutarika, does he know Malawians? He does. He does? He does. Does he have friends? He has friends. 